Now at 11, the first day of early voting is in the books for Central Florida. We're getting new numbers on the turnout with just 15 days until the election. This is News 6 at 11. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. As counties break records for mail-in ballots, voters also flock to the polls today to cast their ballots in person. Let's get straight out to News 6's Lauren Cervantes. She is live in the newsroom breaking down the numbers for us tonight. Lauren. Lisa, according to the Orange County Supervisor of Elections website, 16,780 participated in early voting today. With 20 early voting locations, voters have a chance to cast their ballots from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. at those sites until November 1st when early voting concludes. Day one of early voting has concluded, and the Orange County Supervisor of Elections website shows more than 16,000 voters participated in early voting today. Bill Cowell says it is on track with day one of early voting during the 2016 general election, which he says also saw over 16,000 people that voted. I think part of it's probably because of the huge volume of vote by mail, and so people who previously early voted are now voting by mail and so uh, that may be part of the cause. Cowell says he expected to see a higher volume of voters today. We thought that we'd be a little bit further ahead but again it's just the first day. But while News 6 was out at early voting sites today some voters say they waited in line for hours to cast their ballot. We definitely wanted to make sure we got our, our, our vote in as soon as possible because we know the day of election is going to be a crazy night. Cowell says he expects the lines to continue to grow, urging voters who plan to early vote to do so this week. Try to vote this week because next week when people start thinking about finally going to vote, the lines are going to be longer. Orange County has a tool on their website that allows voters to see the estimated wait times at each of the 20 early voting locations. At the West Oaks Branch Library, it listed the wait time as over an hour at around 5.30 this evening. And sure enough, when we went there to check, voters there said they had been waiting an hour at that time. Osceola County Supervisor of Elections says they also use a tool that provides the wait times of different early voting sites, and we will have that link as well as one to Orange Counties over on our website, clickorlando.com. Lisa. Lauren, reporting live in our newsroom for us tonight. Thank you. And the